Hello everyone, uh, we are going to talk about how to create a new project for Android Studio. So we have to click start a new Android project. So once we start it, uh, we can give the name for the project, like for example, hello app. Uh, we can keep company domain as is and uh, we can decide we are going to save the project, maybe uh, my project next next you're going to create an application for phone and tablet and minimum is decay in my case it will be application 16 android 4.1 so you can choose if you want another platform of course and uh, this all this decay should be installed in your computer next then you're going to create uh, activity for the application. Uh, usually I choose uh, empty activity, not basic activity, because basic activity has these extra features that I don't need it. So I'll have this empty activity. Press next. Keep this, keep this next window unchanged, the name of the activity and layout name, and press finish. Um, so basically when you press finish you have to wait when um, uh, my, my project will be built and uh, information will be loaded into your screen. So in the left side you see my previous project I used before. So basically I'm not using them right now, I'm using new project from the scratch. So once I press OK I receive my basically uh, their project, hello world. Um, so what I have here, basically an Android manifest. I have a Java file, which has some red stuff right now, but uh, after the library will be loaded, these uh, errors will be disappeared. You see right now, it's happened. And you also have a Gradle scripts. Um, it's very important to check your build Gradle to make sure that uh, your compile SDK version and your minimum SDK version is uh, corresponding to your actual device or emulator. So right now we're going to run the project. So since we don't need to fix anything, uh, it's a new project. We just press uh, green button. Then we wait when ADB will be initialized and then we select uh, available virtual device you have in your computer. So if you don't have, you have to create new virtual device. But I already did it before. So create a uh, virtual device IP21. Um, so once I press this message, I see that um, emulator started without any delays and uh, with a full speed. And uh, you see this device is coming right now. So it may take some minutes to wait for target device to come online. So please be patient in this case. Maybe you require it sometimes wait for five minutes um, for the first time because uh, the module should be initialized and all, all things should be set up for the first time. Um, hopefully you, uh, you're not going to wait next time. So um, also you finish, you, you notice that um, the message Gradle build finished in 11 seconds which is a good news, means like your uh, Gradle finished the management of your code and uh, right now your code uh, should be uploaded to the, to the device. Um, you see the message install in APK and it's a success. Alright, so it was a, was a short video about how to start a Hello World project.